Hi, hi, this is James, and welcome back to Storytime with James. Make sure you like, subscribe, and leave me a comment if you like it. And if you would, bless my cash app. Bless my cash app so I can get more acrylic paint, masking tape, and paint brushes. It's for my art. It's for my art, okay? You can view my art on maskingtapetreasures.com. Okay? Right. Okay, this one is called Escaping the Matrix. Yes, yes. Yes, the Matrix was uh, coined by Andrew Tate, but it's actually a movie, okay? If you've seen the, the, the Matrix movie, it's all made up stuff, you know. But then uh, when Andrew Tate got it and started using the term Matrix, then the Passport Bros got it, you know. Look, the Passport Bros are men who who prefer to date foreign women in, in other countries, okay? This is because they believe that Western women have been influenced by cultural and societal pressures to be believe in a, a certain way, you know. You know, therefore, relationships with foreign women seems more genuine, more uh, satisfying, and more peaceful. Okay, it's a shame you have to go so far to, to do that. It's a shame you can't find it in your country, you know, but you're going to have to gamble. You got to go through a whole drove of women in order to find one. Okay. By then, you'll probably be too old, you know. Yes. But you you can find a fit feminine and friendly person, okay? You know, by going there, you know. It's a shame. It's a shame that you got to have to go there. Look, uh it's the uh the system and the structures in society that keeps us bound to the traditional ways of living and working, you know. So it's it's kind of well. I know I'm going to escape the matrix. They they call this the matrix. The 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 U.S. Okay. They call this the matrix. All around here, all around the matrix. You saw the movie. <laughs> you know, you saw the, the matrix movie. But they coined the matrix here, you know. So I don't know if it's, if it it will change or not, but it won't change for the next probably twenty years. You know, twenty years you probably can see some significant changes here. You know, so I don't know, you know, but I tell you what, it's pretty bad now. It's pretty bad. The women here are, are pretty bad, you know. And I have tried a lot of them here. Yes. I've been in so many relationships. But. So many, you know. And and, and it's, it's not good. It's not good to keep. Uh, going from woman to woman, woman to woman, woman to woman. That's not what I'm about. You know? But here, you, you have to do that in order to find the right one. And some, some guys still haven't found the right person, you know? They may have found one that's good for a year or two, and then they... They just uh, break up, you know. 
So now I'm I'm going abroad, you know. I don't have no choice. You know? I'm packing everything up and, and going abroad. You know. Cause uh when I got over there the first time I I had so much peace. A good feeling washed over me, you know. And I'm sure there's a lot of fellas that have went over there and felt the same way, you know. The thing I wish I had could have caught some of it in a can and brought it over here with me so I can have that feeling again, you know. <sighs> mm, mm, mm. Well, I'm I'm leaving. December the 15th, I'll be leaving. I'm out of here. It's done. It's done. I've got a, a few more things to take care of here. Then I'm I'm on the next plane smoking out of here. You know. And a lot of guys are following me. Are, are coming out there too, you know. So get ready for it, you know. Now, uh, I don't think felons can come out there, you know. I, there's There's got to be some way that you can, you know, be able to come out there. But if you're a felon, you can't get a, a passport or nothing like that, you know. So... So if, if you if you are a felon, you need to probably try to get it expunged off your record, you know, or something. That's the only way. It's a lot of people out here that's in poor health. They're, they're in poor health. So they probably can't make it. They can go, but will it be beneficial to their health, you know? So... And, you know, there's people who don't have a lot of money that that try to come over there. But but when you get there, you, you're not going to be able to work, you know, not work in a traditional sense. You know, you'll be able to work online or something. But if you have no skills online or nothing like that, I don't know what you would do because you'll quickly run out of money, you know. Even though everything there, it don't cost a lot, you know, it don't cost a lot. But after spending money, spending money, spending money, you, you're going to run out, especially if you're not making no more to put back in, you know. So keep that in mind, you know, don't fool yourself. But if you come out there and you got your stuff straight. I'm, I guarantee that you'll be a happy camper, okay? Yes. But, mm. yes, it's, it's, it's crazy. I've tried many, many women, you know, here. You know, but I never could settle down with somebody like I have in the Philippines, you know. It's 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 more of a traditional like way of living, you know. A traditional way of living. And it's a good way of living, you know. So uh, yes, it's it's crazy. It's crazy. So if y'all if any of you guys want to come out, just explore it. Explore it. Look on look online and everything like that. And check out what they have to offer, you know. Check out what they have to offer. And I, I, I guarantee you, you can't beat the prices there. You can't beat the, the prices, you know. 
The only only way you're going to spend a lot of money if you order something from up here, you know. But you you can't go wrong when you come out there, you know. So Yes. Yep, it's it's crazy. It's it's crazy that you that I have to go to another country, you know. But I'll be coming back and forth though. I'll I'll be coming to the, the US, you know, just to take care of paperwork and stuff like that. Or if I have to take care of something, I'll come back, then I go right back. You know. So I believe in December the 15th. I'll be in the air then. So, so I got another month. I resign from my job like two weeks before I leave. So that's it. Hip hip hooray. You know. <laughs> All right, you guys. Make sure you like, subscribe, and leave me a comment if you like. And hit that bell notification. Hit that bell notification so that you know every time I drop another video. And share, share, share. Share my videos with everyone, okay? Share them with your friends. Share them with your family. Share them with your loved ones. And even share them with your enemies, too. <laughs> All right, you guys. Peace. Adios. Salamat. Chair dance. <laughs>